Hello, kindergarten students. It's Mrs. Belatash, and we are going to start a new part of our science unit. The first part, we talked about materials. We talked about wood, and we talked about paper. We saw that we could change the wood by sanding it. We could put some glue in the sawdust and make a strong piece of wood like the particle board. We saw that we could use paper and glue and water and make a bowl out of paper mache. So we could change those materials. Now, we are going to make some different materials Move. And I have some little toy trucks. Oh, I love to play with cars and trucks. And they're just sitting here on my floor. Are they moving? No, they're not moving. What can I do to get them to move? Well, I can give them a push, or I can pull them back. So I can push and pull, push and pull. It's fun to play with cars. All right, I have one of my stools here in the science lab, and I, if I want to make it move, I have to give it a push, right? I have to give it a push. How can I pull it to myself? Well, I'm gonna use this string. I'm gonna put it through the, the legs and I'm going to pull the chair to me. So I can push or I can pull. Okay, I've got a ball and I'm playing with the ball. And if I do nothing, if I just leave the ball there, it's not going to move, right? It just stays still. If I want the ball to move, I need to push it or pull it. I'm going to give it a little push. I'm going to give it a really soft, gentle push. Okay, it doesn't move very far. When I give it a soft, gentle push, I'm going to give it another soft, gentle push. Yeah, it moves really slowly when I push it softly and gently. Now, I'm gonna take my ball and I'm gonna give it a hard push. Wow, it went pretty fast. I gave you guys a tennis ball in your bag. Can you put it on the desk or put it on the floor and give it a soft push? See what happens when you push it softly. You don't push too hard. Then give it a hard push. Wow, see what happens when you push it really hard. I've got my ball here again, boys and girls, and I want to teach you something that's really important in science, and it's called cause and effect. So here's the ball. And if I hit the ball, if I push the ball, then I make the ball move. I am the cause and the effect is the motion of the ball. So I'm going to push on it and it's going to move. Sometimes boys and girls, there's a force that acts on our ball that we can't really see. If I let go of my ball, what's going to happen to it? It's going to fall to the ground. Am I pushing the ball down? What's happening? Let's watch. I didn't push the ball. I just let go. There was a pulling force that was pulling the ball down and that force is called gravity. I'm gonna go outside and see if I can find some more examples of pushing and pulling around school. Hey, Miss Ava, what are you doing? Hi, Miss Lori. I'm going to give a chicken rudder. I'm pulling my rudder. All right, those lucky chickens. Miss Diana, what are you going to do? I love to play in the playground, so I'm going to walk the stairs and go into the slides. 
All right. Oh, that looks like fun. Well, there's Mrs. Crowell and Mrs. Fonder. What are you guys doing? Hi, we're playing ball. This is uh, Bellatash. Wow. Well, what are you doing here? What are you? What, how, what are you gonna do with it? I'm gonna take the ball and I'm gonna push it and to Mrs. Fonder. Oh, thank you, Mrs. Crowell. I'm gonna push it to Mrs. Crowell now. Awesome. Woo! Keep going. Oh Whoa, we're gonna just keep going. Wow. Right. Wow. Push. Push. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Bye, Mrs. Hey, Principal Martinez, what you doing? Hey, everybody. I'm out here playing a little basketball. I'm so inspired by the Los Angeles Lakers winning the championship. I'm going to do my best LeBron James. I'm going to push the basketball into the hoop. Here it goes. Push. Oh, my gosh. Push. Please go. Yeah! Uh-oh. Gravity's not pulling down hey, enough. Coach Marty, what you doing? Hey, I'm dribbling the soccer ball, which is basically pushing the ball. I'm using force to push the soccer ball. Boy, that's some fancy hand ball handling, Coach Marty. Well, also now I'm juggling the ball, but I'm pushing the ball up with my body. Oh, yeah. Up. And right now, I need to take a break. Hi, Mrs. Eltoon. What are Hi. you doing here? Hi, Mrs. can you please get out your science notebook and we're going to turn to the page that says what causes objects to move and what did if I wanted to move the ball what do I have to do I can push it or I can pull it so this is what I wrote I can push the ball. I can pull the car. <laughs>